Hello, India. Hello, India. Hello, India. Hello, everyone. And welcome to the second video of Culture Arts Mandarin Chinese for Beginners video series. In this video series, we will be teaching you the basic Chinese words and phrases that you'll need to have daily conversations in Chinese and travel in China on your own. If you haven't done it yet, make sure to subscribe by clicking the subscribe button below so you don't miss out on the next videos. If you've never studied Chinese before, we suggest you start with our first video, which we will link in the description down below. In today's video, we will teach you how to ask and answer how are you in Mandarin Chinese. Today's video will start with a short dialogue completely in Mandarin Chinese, which we will then break down for you. At the end of this video, we will play it again, and this time, you'll be able to do it on your own. Shall we start? Let's start! Hello, Bye-bye! So now, let's go to the classroom and break down this dialogue so you can learn and understand it and do it on your own. So now, let's go over today's dialogue. We have started with 你好. If you've watched our first video, you should probably know by now that 你好 means hello in Chinese. Now we said 你好, Andia, 你好, Ilya. Andia is Eden's Chinese name. Ilya is my Chinese name. Andia, Eden. Ilya, Ilya. After we said our hellos, we said Ni Zemayang, which is how you ask, how are you in Chinese, colloquially. Ni, if you remember from the from our first class, means you. Zemayang means something like how is, how is something. So similarly to what we learned with the question what in the first video, the question word how is comes after the noun. So it comes where the answer would be. So how are you? And then the answer will be I am great. You can use zemayan also to ask other questions. For example, gongzo, which means work. If you ask gongzo zemayan, that means How's your work? Or Zuijin recently. Go Zuijin Zamayan would mean how have you been recently? Yeah, so here will be what you're asking about, and then Zamayan. So to answer the question how are you in Chinese, today I want to show you three different ways how to do it. By different gradations of greatness. Starting with Okay. Hi, how? You're probably already familiar with the how, right? From ni how. How how means well. Hi how means quite well. The second one, on a level higher. Tin how da, which also means quite or pretty, but in Chinese. This is on a level higher, yeah? So if you just want to say okay, you would say hai hao. If you want to say good, you would say ting hao da. And the last one, it's a bit confusing because the literal meaning is not bad, bu zuo. But actually, when you say not bad in Chinese, it means great. You can add the wo at the beginning. So me, wo, wo hai hao. 我挺好的,我不错. Or you can also say it without the 我. For consistency sake, in our video, we added the 我. A few things to pay attention in terms of pronunciation. The H in Chinese is much more pronounced than it is in English. Notice how I say it. 海, or here, 好. If you remember the NG sound, it's like this very nasal N, yeah, so ting, ting, yeah, it's like very much you're like blowing through your nose. And the last thing, when you see a C at the beginning, it's a ts, like a TS sound. Tso, bu tso. On a small cultural note, ni is something you would use 
to speak to young urban Chinese. But when you speak to an older generation or you're traveling in China and you're outside of the big cities, you would not hear it that often. What you would hear instead would be like more questions that concern with you in a more direct way. For example, people might ask you, have you eaten already? Or, oh, you're going, oh, you're back, or you're traveling. So it's some kind of like a comment on your state or some kind of a question about your well-being. But if you're in an urban, young setting, Nizamayang will, will make you sound very cool. The last thing we saw in today's video was me and Eden saying goodbye. We said, Zaijian, and bye-bye. If you want to know more about this, you can go to our first video where we explain it a bit more in detail. Thank you. Now let's watch the video again and see if this time you can understand the whole dialogue and do it on your own. 你好,Andia。你好,Ilya。你怎么样?我挺好的。你怎么样?我还好。再见。Bye-bye. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed today's video, please make sure to like, subscribe, and if you have any questions, please leave it in the comment section below. If you're interested in studying Mandarin Chinese live online, you can visit our website at www.cultureyard.net, which is also linked in the description down below. Bye-bye!